All right, guys, we start now. This will be the head first, you know. I always start with the head. Of course, I will wait a little bit <coughs> for the stream to start in YouTube itself. And then we'll continue. I'm a little bit, a little bit sick, but not nothing too serious. So we are fine and we start now. This will be our head. I will try to do it pointing up. So I don't advise you to do that. I tried a few times and it's not very easy to do it pointing up. But since I'm a professional, I have to be able to do it. Uh, that's why I'm doing it, you know, that's why. So yeah, let's do this now. You hear me? Everything is okay. I think so. Nobody says anything. So we are fine. This is the head. It's ready. We can continue. No, it's not ready, but it will be at some point. It has to be Superman. It has to be a thick neck, kind of a squarish head, squarish jaw and stuff like this. And again, uh, this is not a very simple. I mean, it's a simple concept. It's not an ultra simple concept because it's a whole character with legs and arms and the Superman emblem with I plan to do, which will take time. So yeah, if I don't answer your questions or your um, questions uh, like, but Nico, uh, why uh, are you having a blue shirt, a blue t-shirt this time? Again, like always. But Nico, uh, why are you having just one eyebrow? Next time, can you have five eyebrows? It will be difficult, but this type of questions, maybe I will not be able to answer all of them. I will try, but I don't, you know, I don't see everything because I'm trying to do something like a model. Yeah. Unfortunately, that's what we are here and that's what you are here for the model mostly. And maybe for a little bit of Nico treatment, Nico is a little bit rough sometimes, but you know that, so it's fine. Greetings from Norway. Oh, greetings, Norway. Hello from Greece. Oh, we have Greece. Yeah, sometimes we have Greece. Sometimes we have um, uh, very good countries. I mean, <laughs> all the countries are good, of course, except the bad ones. Which are the bad ones, Nico, you will ask. But Nico, which are the bad countries? I will not answer these questions. Okay, I will answer. I cannot uh, help it. <clears throat> North Korea. I, I mean, it's probably not the, the, the bad country, but the rulers are not exactly the, the best. Let's see. And we can say that because everybody knows that, so it's fine. But Nico, why do you have a black shirt this time? A very good question. Black shirt? Ooh. I could have a black shirt, by the way, but it will be the same like my chair, so it's not going to be fine. So for the first 10 minutes, we have to do the head. Otherwise, it will be ruined. Uh, we will not be able to do anything. So we have to be fast, furious and all of that, you know, things. Mostly fast and furious. That's very important. So let's continue. From time to time, uh, what I'm doing is uh, when my uh, thought kind of is gone, when I have no more anything to say, which is very rare occasion, but still uh, I kind of look at the chat and then I kind of see somebody and I get a subject, the some subject. So I cannot see all of the things. I'm just throwing an eye to the chat from time to time, not all the time, obviously. But yeah, is that what Nico does after the events of GTA 4? Yeah. This is what Nico Bellic does after the events of GTA 4. He became a character artist in Gameloft and then he's teaching young people, young people um, Blender and ZBrush and stuff like this. ZBrush not so much, but you know why, you know, you know why. By the way, I told you that Maxon called me and told me not to mess with the software because I'm too fast for them and they don't want people to be that fast in ZBrush because it's kind of, um, you know, making ZBrush uh, less important. It looks like it's very easy, 
That's why they, they told me, go away from our software. Yeah, but also Blender called, called me and say, can you start Blender? Because we, we like that you are fast and we want our software to look like more easy, more smooth. And I say, okay, it's cool. Both companies want basically the same thing. Uh, I mean, it's completely fine by me. And uh, for somebody who is new here in this channel to think that I'm uh, serious, uh, hopefully it will not happen. It's not exactly the most serious thing, but it's fun. Indonesia, greetings from Latvia, Algeria, Indonesia, very good. Ukraine, very nice. Romania, of course, Romania. You love my eyebrow. I thought that in Egypt and uh, the Arabic countries, they love my eyebrow, but if you like it in Romania too, I guess it's fine. But do you know who uh, has to like my eyebrow? Myself, mostly. It's the most important. Uh, the, other, the other people, I mean, yeah. Do you live for others or for yourself? Who knows? That's another... That's for another conversation, we may say. And while we are talking, how many? Okay, for six minutes, we have basics of our head with neck. Very important, with neck and some traps. So, yeah. I will take our time a little bit with the head, since the head is the most important thing. And uh, the body, of course, ah, the body is pretty important. This is Superman, we have to make it, you know. We cannot leave it unattended. Did you have a nice weekend? Ah, pff, just a normal weekend, not the nicest, not the worst. Nothing too special for the weekend. Let me just do this, okay. Okay. Alright, now. Starting to work, I think. Let's see those eyes, how to do it. Well, they will be like half spheres. And then from the bottom also half spheres. But they have to be closer to the eyebrows like this. So I'll push them up. Because as close to the eyebrows you made them, the more manly he will look. Yeah, for the female it will not be very nice, but for a male character it will be cool. Then we will make some just eyebrows. All right, he almost looks like a Superman now. And of course we can go back to the to the face at some point. But now we have to hurry and make the hair. But not before I make the uh, favorite muscle of everybody, the sternocleidomastoid muscle, which we always know that it has to be there and we have to make it work. Otherwise, uh, you know, somebody will suffer. It, we, we have to make the sternocleidomastoid. It's very important muscle. It's the most important muscle in the human body. If you don't have this muscle, you basically are doomed. You know, when they cut off this muscle of some people back in the medieval times, most of the time those people didn't survive, you know, because this is your neck muscle here and it's, it's from both sides. And when you remove it, when you like <coughs> cut it, either with a guillotine or with a axe, most of the time uh, the patients don't survive this operation. So the sternocleidomastoid, very important muscle, as we know. The ears, yeah. One of the, the 10 gravest mistakes uh, is when you don't make, <laughs> I was about to say with, when you don't make love to the ears, which is not very good to say, when you don't make the ears right, it's the right thing to say probably. And since this is a stylized character, you we don't want to make them super, super, you know, realistic or something. But anyway, I think it's it's fine. All right, from the front view, he looks relatively fine. His head is not pointing too much up, so I will do this. Since my computer is okay, I can go and just move him to point up a little bit. 
and that should do. Maybe too much up, I but we'll see. No. Yeah, he will be more expressive, let's say. Yeah, I guess it's fine. Now let's do the hair. Another sphere, just move it, position it, scope mode, control R, continue. Let's answer a few questions and continue. Hello from Russia, hello Russia. Both have the same blue shirt. Yes, greeting from India. Ooh, India. Yeah, very good. Um, hi from Greece and thanks for the videos, uh, really inspiring. Uh, yeah, I hope so, I hope so. I'm uh, hoping that the videos that I'm doing here will inspire people to just not be afraid of uh, sculpting in Blender, in ZBrush, doesn't matter. I mean, many people are saying, ah, pff, you know, ZBrush is the best sculpting program, why are you doing it in Blender? But you see, in Blender you can do almost everything and it's not that scary or uh, bad or whatever. It happens and it happens pretty nicely. So we have to acknowledge this. Hey Nico, love from Armenia. Ooh, Armenia, for the first time I see somebody from Armenia. Very good, very good. I like it. That eyeball height tip is one of the things I will always remind myself now. Amazing tip. <laughs> eyeball height. Um, I don't know what you're talking about, but still, probably something I've said. Uh, since I talk a lot, I say a lot of things. But uh, for... In my opinion, you have to remember a couple of things. Sternocleidomastoid is one of the most important ones. And um, you have to remember, the last stream, we talked about one type of uh, single cells organisms, which live on the bottom of the Mariana Trench. Nobody saw them, but we know they are there. And they are... Uh, you know, uh, I talked about them last time. Maybe we will talk them about them uh, again. Love your work. Didn't have a fast PC. So which method is better for sculpting? Dinotopo or Multires? Multires is, is crap. Um, remesh is the best option for you, I think. I mean, in sculpt mode, even more lower level PCs can handle some polygons. Of course, after like 3-4 million polygons, low level PCs will start to crumble. Uh, which is normal, so you have to be careful. Now, for example, this head now is uh, less than a million, which is completely okay, and then all the character will be like 5 million probably or something. We'll see. But yeah, with low-level PC, I mostly recommend, and I'm sorry that I have to say it, but I recommend for you to use ZBrush. Uh, because ZBrush is uh, can handle a lot more polygons, in uh, many low-level PCs, it's working uh, very, very good. And yeah, I shouldn't say it like this, but it's, you know. Nico, do you think you had course releases this year? Uh, hopefully, hopefully. If I don't get sick or something, I'm still training for the course. I may show you some trainings I did today in, the, in this file, there in this file. I'm just working on one file for everything sometimes. But yeah, so... Maybe. Should be this year, even should be next month. Head exercises course. It will be great. As always, you know. I'll just leave it like this, it's more expressive. No, no, this is too thick at the end. In the end, it should be thinner. And it's difficult, it's very difficult to rotate it like, like this, but I will try. You know? Ah, it's cool. Now it's fine. Okay. We have finished with the head. It looks fine. Safe. Uh, always safe, by the way. It's, uh, I always say that saving is, uh, it's gonna save your ass, you know, sometimes. Ooh, I said ass. No problem. I think ass is okay to be said. Maybe if I say but, will be better. Or uh, the the lower part of your back or something. I don't know which one is the best, but still, yeah. Now, you, you say, but Nico, why are you doing this? Why are you pointing? I mean, wh what's happening with his body? Why is it so forward? Ah, because the concept is like this, you know. It's a pretty cool concept, by the way. Superman looks handsome like you. I, I thank you very much, but I know you're lying. It's cool. 
Hello from Turkey, hello from Turkey, hello from Moldova, Moldova, very nice. Turkey gang, you, a lot of people from Turkey these days. You're very active. Hello from Belarus, ooh, Belarus people again. I, I like people when, when they come from Belarus, you know, or I, I will be the most happy guy when people from North Korea came. I mean, it will be amazing. But um, probably not anytime soon. Uh, somebody can lie that he's from North Korea and we'll be happy. All of us will happy. We'll be happy. <laughs> All of us will be happy. What's happening here? My English is just improving in just every day. Every hour I'm improving my English. Pull it forward a bit. Yeah, we have to pull it forward a bit, I think so, yes. The body. It should be more like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I will see. We'll see. I mean, don't worry. I will handle it. I have this. I have an eye for these things. How to do it? By the way, this guy uh, is not very famous guy. I don't think he has an art station even. The guy who made the concept. Uh, his name is in the description of the video. You can always see him. Uh, he has a Deviant Art page, and uh, I saw his works in. Uh, in Pinterest and it's pretty cool it's pretty cool nice things he has uh, you know very interesting poses we may say as you can see and it looks uh, cool for me it looks cool I like to do this kind of strange and action poses and stuff so for me uh, his style is fine as you can see I'm pretty pretty excited about everything i'm super super excited hello from algeria very cool very cool uh a head exercise course will be great i have been practicing on ears female and other head exercise is coming uh speech our life could you stream three or more hours a day i can like five hours a day no problem but uh, nobody will watch it it's uh it will be too much for the people to handle i mean me even for two hours it's uh i mean too much my wife barely can handle me for like uh, half an hour or two minutes sometimes so for this kind of uh you know we have to be careful not to overdo it you know to relax all right, the face, I don't completely approve it yet, but we'll see what happens. Here we'll have um, cape. Yeah. Hello, Nico, and Chris, will it be better to work on each video until mastering it? Uh, no, uh, don't work on each video until you master it. I think it's better to watch the course, do what you can. And then, why don't you watch it again and do again? what you can, and it will be better the second time, I promise. Hello from Ohio, USA. Ohio, USA, all right, all right, all right, very good. We have USA here, very nice. USA today, but we always have USA, I think. Because, you know, USA, a lot of people. Much more than, uh, I mean, uh, people in the USA are... Uh, kind of the same as people in Europe almost you know almost the same number in whole Europe you know that's why probably there are always people from USA in the stream I think but of course we never can be too sure what am I doing you will ask I'm just uh, trying to do the body how much time? Ooh, 20 minutes. We have to start the arms because they will be the most difficult thing probably, except for the face. The face is always kind of the most difficult, but yeah, the arms also will be, yeah, you see, ass, little ass, very cool. I'm always doing, it's very good to, to make a good ass, you know. Hello from Armenia, hello Armenia. Uh, but Nico, when you will learn how to pronounce the sound like thing uh it, that's a good question by the way that's an original question i like it and uh n never problem yeah 
they first uh, pay me attention to this. I mean, not pay me attention, but they first uh, brought my attention to this uh, this thing when I was in Thailand. In Thailand, although people in Thailand they cannot say they they cannot say rice. They say rye most of the time. I mean, some of them probably can, but whatever. They say rye, and I was having a difficult time understanding some uh, in the beginning. But you can you get used to it. So you probably will get used to my th sound, but, 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 you know, you'll get used to it. It's fine. Save and well, go to object mode and then sphere. And the sphere is the fastest way for me, at least to make the arms and the legs. So let's do this A sphere. This will be one of the arms. Of course, the other one will be symmetrical, so don't worry. Don't worry about it too much. We'll do it. No issues. All right. Greetings from Canada. Canada. I haven't heard about that that country. Which one is this? I mean, Canada probably, but Canada. Do you have six six packs? Not even in my fridge. I don't have no. I don't have six packs at all. I have never had, and I probably never will, but you don't you never know. Maybe someday I will start getting this kind of interesting chemistry chemistry chemi chemistry stuff. And uh who knows? But when I'm old and I am sick of the life uh and I wanna just, you know, die in horrible pain, probably then I will start taking steroids. And I will have the six pack for kind of a week. Uh -huh. Watching from Russia. Oh, is this a threat that you're watching from Russia? Really? I mean, I feel a little bit, you know, afraid. They're watching you from Russia. Be afraid. Ah, as long as you're not from uh, the office of your uh, president, it's okay. It's fine. Everything else is cool. Finally called stream live. Greetings from Namibia, Africa. Ooh, haha, <laughs> amazing. Namibia, Africa. Very cool. That's exotic, you know. Well, India, eh, not so exotic. Like, Indians are a lot of people. And many of them are in the internet. And they always call me sir. I like that. I don't know. It's just uh, respectful, you know. It's 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 good. Um but Namibia I have um, haven't haven't seen people from Namibia too much. In the stream, I mean. But even live probably, not so many. Very cool. Nigeria. Very cool. Nigeria, Namibia. I love seeing people from Africa here. Very nice. You're distracting me a little bit from the, the arms. I need to concentrate. But still, you know, I'm streaming, so I cannot uh, complain. <laughs> I'm complaining that uh, I'm streaming and the people in the chat are... Uh, what kind of streamer are you, Nico? Probably a bad one, who knows. Hi from France, I have a question. Did you switch for, for Blender instead ZBrush because of the new prices of ZBrush? Not at all. Not at all. New prices of ZBrush, I bought it in the new prices of ZBrush. Before I bought ZBrush, I may say I haven't had it uh, bought. Uh, you know, You know what I mean. Uh, so, I bought it like one year ago, maybe, yeah. Before that I was doing courses about ZBrush. I was I was teaching myself and the other people ZBrush. That's why I didn't have it bought. But at, at one point I decided that I'm very good in ZBrush and I bought it. It was one year ago and just before one year. And then um, I went to Blender and uh, that's it. Now I'm using only Blender. 
But why, Nico? Why did you do this to us? We believed in you. We swore in you. You are our zebrish god. But now I can be your blender god, you know? It's completely fine. It's fine. No problem. Don't. No. No issues. Yes, we're always watching you from Russia. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, guys, it's time to pack my things and go to some other country. I will not say where I will go, but obviously Russians are on me. Because I said some things about their president. I've said some things about the war in Ukraine. I've said some things and now it's, it's on, you know. But let them come here in Bulgaria. It's okay. We have Rakia. Uh, they are used to drink vodka, you know. But vodka is weak. I mean, we have Rakia here. It's uh, sometimes around 50, 55 degrees uh, of alcohol. So, yeah. Come here. Bulgaria is a very nice place. You will feel right at home even more so. Hi from South Africa. Oh, South Africa. Yeah, very good. Very good. I love South Africa because uh, the guy from South Africa gave me my video card that I'm using right now. Ah, I forgot to ask him if he uh, will agree uh, to show his uh, uh, his Instagram here. I should ask him some at some point. But yeah, it will be fine. Now, in order to see the hand as we're supposed to see it, we have to uh, duplicate it like this. And now it doesn't look very nice. I don't like it completely. So we will continue working on it. It will take time, definitely. So the arms will take maybe more time than anything else. The other things are like ah, fast, furious, everything is fine. But the arms, they will take time. Hello, Nico and chat. Hello. Hello from Moldova. Moldova, yeah, very good, very good. Hello from Sat Saturn. Of course, of course. Hello, Nico. Do you know online courses club? No, I don't know this club. Why are they doing in this club? Are they doing online courses? Wow. But you know, I'm doing online courses for, let's say, like five years now or something. Uh, so without a club, and I'm doing relatively fine. Why should I need the club? That's the question. Why? Do I need the club? I don't know. Okay. You are funny. Uh, sometimes, yes. Sometimes, yes. Namibia. Ah, Namibia, very cool. Come to Brazil. Everyone is welcome here. Oh, everyone is welcome everywhere. I mean, I like to come. I, I've came. I, I mean, I've been, I've been in Brazil. I've been in Brazil, in Rio de Janeiro, in Iguazu waterfalls. It was cool. Uh, but I've never been in Russia, which I want to go. But maybe someday. Maybe someday, when everything kind of relaxed, when the situation relaxed, I would like to visit Russia a lot. I would like to eat pelmen. Uh, but real Russian pelmen. Drink real Russian vodka. And, uh, you know, selotka. And everything will be amazing. Vodka with selotka. Very nice. Please, please, it doesn't matter where you go. We will find you and we will continue to watch. Aha. Uh -huh. So just, uh, okay. No problem. Russians. Hi, Nico. I was watching a recorded live for you just now. And I didn't know you were actually alive. <laughs> yeah. What a co coincidence. Watching the recorded life and suddenly real life appears. What is happening? You know, I'm not watching uh, too much the concept for this, for the arms, which is a mistake because, you know, in the concept they look fine. So if we do them kind of like the concept, we will be okay. But I'm relying on my. Uh, on the library in my head and stuff like this, which sometimes can fool you. So always use references. And when you're using references, watch your references. Because sometimes even I forgot forgot 
to watch my references and I start to do something completely, you know, different and what's happening. And th at the end, it's not bad, but because I have uh, kind of some years of experience, let's say. But for most people, I advise you to watch your references and keep yourself into it. Nico, why do you think that did Maxon surprise us with more ZBrush news this year? And do you honestly think you can really substitute ZBrush with Blender on AAA character? It depends on the uh, AAA character. It depends on the game. Yeah. And the other question below it, I uh, just missed it. missed it. I cannot see it. Hello from Paraguay. Very nice. Nico, how are you going to do Lex if you don't do a video about that in your all, uh, other channel? Ah, that's a good question. That's a good question and you remind me that I have to do it. I thought that people are not inter interested in that matter anymore, but if you are saying it, probably people are interested and I have to uh, just practice for a few days and do it. Because, you know, practicing is always good. Even for me. Although I can do Lex. But to practice, uh, to be able to teach you how to do them, it's, it's mandatory. You have to do it, basically. Hello from Slovakia. Hello, Slovakia. Hello, Nico. Do you ever sculpt an action figure? Oh, <laughs> I always sculpt action figures. No. Uh, I mean, uh, an action figure, you mean the figure who you can move the joints and stuff like this. Yes, I understand. No, I haven't made actual figure like that yet. But it's never too late. Maybe I will, maybe I will not. Who knows? Nobody knows where life will take us at some point. But Nico, why did you left ZBrush for Blender? But Nico, why do you have one eyebrow? But Nico, hello from Sarajevo. Sarajevo again. Yeah, last time you were here again. Bought your Lobo course, can't wait to finish and 3D print it. Hmm, I haven't 3D printed it myself yet. <laughs> but I'm planning to do it. I mean, I have to do it uh, soon. But the guy who I sent it to, he told me that uh, he needs uh, separate uh, parts and I'm too lazy to do it. So now I'm, I'm just, uh, you know, to do it these days. Because it will stay very nice into my Instagram. I will upload it in the Instagram when I receive the 3D print. Most likely. Hello from Odessa, Ukraine. I guess. Odessa is in Ukraine. Yeah. Yeah, you know, uh, if I say something which is stupid, I'm sorry, but sometimes, you know, uh, even I can make mistakes. Although, I never make mistakes, of course, but yeah, sometimes, in some very rare occasions, even Nico can make a little bit of mistake. But Odessa, I'm almost sure it's in Ukraine. Hello from Andromeda, which is in... I don't know where it is, but probably a joking, so it's fine. Uh, Nico, my Dragon Rider was good, and I'm starting Lobo now. Your, your Dragon Rider is very nice, by the way. And the Lobo, I um, I can't wait to see what Lobo can you do, because, you know, Dragon Rider is a cartoon character. Lobo is kind of stylized, but it's not exactly cartoon. Have you noticed that I'm doing those arms for, like few hours now too much time for arms i think we have to go and do some legs and then go back to the arms again because they are not ready in any any case they're not ready at all uh, we will have problems with the arms because they are difficult arms are always hard to do especially forearms and sometimes I manage to do them, sometimes I don't quite. Finally, I'm here live. Me too. So excited. Very nice to be here live. I have Unibrow too. Mohamed said that, uh, yeah, when I was in Egypt, a lot of people there had Unibrows like me. And that's why I felt at home in Egypt, you know. And also in other Arabic countries, they have Unibrows. Maybe I'm an Arab um, kind of, uh, I have an Arab heritage or something. I'm not sure. 
But yeah, my grand my grandmother was uh, Bulgarian, so uh, before that, I'm almost sure they are also Bulgarians. But still, we have you know some mixing here in Bulgaria. So who knows? I don't know. Could be something Arabic in me. Nobody knows. But I don't know Arabic. I mean, the language, no. But Sir Nico, how and when you started character sculpting? Ooh, I started a long time ago. I mean, uh, 12 years ago, maybe. I would say, like, amount of poly on screen, ZBrush can handle a lot more, of course. Mm. Yeah, True 3D with Blender is very cool. It's cheap these days. You can buy a good one from AliExpress. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about, but it's cool. Hi from Chile. Ooh, Chile. A fan of your work. Maybe download Blender and try. Very cool. That's very cool. That looks very nice. For the last few days, I've just been watching the past recording of each stream because I'm always too late. But now you're here, which is great. How fast you start sculpting in Blender after ZBrush? Ah, it took me about, let's say, tens of hours to kind of uh, get as fast as in ZBrush. Like, let's say, 30, 40 hours. Maybe, but you see, I was sculpting for many, many years uh, already, so it wasn't that difficult for me. Well, let's make the legs and we will see how everything will fit together. Uh, because without the legs, and the legs also will be difficult, uh, bear, bear in mind that they will not be easy. Because they are very curvy and interesting, but they will be hard to do. Mark my words. And I will curse. So, prepare yourself for some cursing from Niku himself. No, I will probably not curse. Fuck this legs. No, no, I will be okay. Hello from Sweden. I just want to tell you that you are the best YouTube channel I have ever witnessed for sculpting characters. I'm still learning, but I find that you have helped me a lot. Thank you. Thank you very much from Sweden. No, I'm from Bulgaria. Thank you very much, and uh, yeah, that's uh, very inspiring for me to hear these uh, little stories, I mean, that people are inspired and they like my channel, they like what I do. This particular channel is my second channel. The other one is more for learning, this one is more for just having fun, you know, just, you know, it inspires me, it, um, it makes me, you know, Makes me what? I don't know what, but whatever. It's uh, it charges me. We may say even. It makes me super charged. Very cool. Now, uh, control R, smooth, and the those feet are always the worst. I mean, I always hate the beginning of making the feet because they always look very, very, very bad in the beginning. And then at some point they start to look eh, kind of okay, but they never look completely okay. Have you noticed that? I don't know. In my case, always. Of course, when you put some shoes and when you kind of are you are, you are careful about the shoes and everything, then the things kind of came out. My blender can't handle too many polys and most of them it crashes. Do you think my computer could not handle ZBrush? To no, it will handle ZBrush much better. I'm sure because ZBrush is. Ah, uh, for that, I mean, I always say that uh, ZBrush is better with low level computers and that's it. So I advise you, which is against my instincts, but you have to go to ZBrush. No, it's not. I mean, <laughs> we have to stop that. I, I told you already, the war between ZBrush and Blender uh, is not existing. We are making it, but it's not a war. I mean, ZBrush and Blender are softwares that you can sculpt on, obviously, on both of them. and uh, if you want to use one of them, if you want to use the other one, nobody cares. I mean, uh, you have to do what you have to do to make nice characters and organic modeling as a whole, because that's what I do and that's what I like to do. That's what I love to do, organic stuff. But of course, I have to do other type of stuff, as I show in my courses. I do weapons, I do armors, I do whatever. I do whatever it takes to make money uh, from uh, you. What? 
No, of course it's uh, it's true. Everybody is uh, making uh, everything for money, for example. Or yeah, uh, uh, this thing that I'm doing now, I'm sculpting here. I'm making it for fun, mostly. But the courses, I'm making them a little bit for fun. Yes, I'm I'm having fun while, while I'm making courses. Of course, it's almost the same as uh, as here. But in the courses, I'm more into educating. I'm more into saying what I'm doing. Uh, in here, I'm just, you know, messing around and having fun. That's, that's the thing, you know. And probably it's, it's fine. I mean, uh, if people are liking it and you're saying you're liking it, so I guess we are on the right path in here. Right path. With this channel. This channel is going the right way. The right way. My way or the highway. Limbiscuit is rocking the space like a Russian roulette, just a place in your bed. You know it's sad, but you know what I mean, and everything happened for a reason. But Nico, when you sculpt a character that will be animated later on, are you preparing the separated eyes, tongue, and teeth, or do you leave that for the person who does the retopo? <laughs> I'm preparing everything uh, separately, and uh, you know, since the guy who is doing my retopos these days is uh, a friend of mine, a very good character artist too, but he doesn't mind doing retopo. Um, so that's why I'm giving him if I have something like freelance or something, and he's doing better job uh, in the retopology than me, so eh, I'm okay with that. So he knows how to do all the stuff without any problem, so I don't have to basically do it, but I do it, since I'm a responsible guy, we may say, and I do it. Zibosh has nice tools for prototyping, sketching, mentioning, various for yes. Hello Nico, is possible do tiny details in Blender like pores for example, is the same way in ZBrush? No, it's not exactly the same way and you have to have at least like uh, 32 gigabytes of RAM at least and uh, kind of a nicer video card, you have to do separate meshes and you have to sometimes uh, hide some meshes until you work on others, for example, you have to do some tricks basically but you have to ask for that because I haven't tried it even. I have to ask for that, uh, Stefan Hartmann, who is the guy who is making incredible stuff in ZBrush. I showed him, showed his stuff in my um, other streams. He's uh, doing, he's better than me in anatomy, and he, he's doing realistic, creepy stuff in Blender. But amazing, I mean, hands down, amazing stuff. I always say that. You know, we artists can always um, appreciate another good artist, you know. Okay, now it's time to move on the legs forward and more forward and like this. And those feet are amazingly bad, but we'll fix them. How much time we have? Okay, for 40 minutes we have... Uh, yeah, yeah, but uh, still, two hours. This will be two hours. So, relax enjoy we will be here for at least maybe one one hour and a half more than than now so from now on almost one hour and a half more to get a good result because i need to do even the superman logo on his chest which will take at least 10 minutes at least just the logo itself so you know some things takes time we cannot say they're not they're not taking time and I will, I will try to make the fists a little bit not so boring, because they now look very boring. And the boring is not our friend at all. We don't like boring. The boring is... You know, we have to throw it away from the window. Do you shade smooth after sculpting? Sometimes, yes. How much Gameloft was paying you? Around 2,000 euro, um, you know, after taxes. Is better to sculpt stylized characters or realistic for beginner? Uh, for beginner, I don't know what... Uh, I mean, it depends what you are trying to do and what um, exactly do you want to do. I mean, what is your passion? 
for me, my passion is more re not realistic characters, uh, stylized ones and cartoon characters. I like to do most. That's why, uh, and I'm very fast at doing them, as you can see. But for a beginner, it depends what kind of characters you like to do. If you like to do uh, realistic, you have to try to do realistic. You have to learn your anatomy. And for even for uh, stylized characters, you have to learn the anatomy too. It's just, uh, you know, see, stylized character, but without the anatomy, I won't be able to do nice arms and legs and uh, the body and everything will not be as good, most likely. Not that it's very good right now, but it, yeah. Now, look what I'll do. Just, you know, I would like him to stay without falling. And that's what I'm doing. This is... A little bit exaggeration of a hero pose, uh, which I like. I mean, <laughs> that's what I like about this concept is that it's it's funny. It's exaggerated hero pose. It's like, you know, uh, so much. That's very good. How you rotate the model in your config? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm just rotating the model with the, you know, with the tools in ZBrush. The most funniest artist in the internet. Huh. Is that a compliment? I don't know. Because, for example, yeah, you say I'm an artist. Okay, good. But am I a good artist? Or just funny artist? Ah, <laughs> Nico is so funny. Uh, if he was good, it would be amazing. You know? But he's just funny. It's okay. It's, he's funny. So we watch him. We watch him. It's fine. Do you shade smooth after sculpting? Sometimes, yes, I told you. Do you make retopology to our characters? Rarely. Uh, does it really necessary for 3D printing or selling on the 3D market on any other things? No, for 3D printing, it's not necessary to have retopology. That's why I'm not doing retopology. Because most of the time, I'm 3D printing them. Uh, yes. Uh, no. Uh, okay. And you will ask, but Nico, who are you talking to? Just to myself. I'm thinking some things and then answering, you know? Using ZBrush over Blender is like using EV over Cycles. It has more performance by faking. Both of them are good. Yes, of course. Nico, did you try uh, 3D Code? Uh, not so much. Hey man, started in concept art and level design this year professionally. Your videos really helped me to start and understand more. Thanks. Really? Level design? Why? I'm not... Am I doing level design here without knowing what's happening here? Level design. Concept art. But the concept art... Hmm. I'm not doing concept art too. What is happening here? Maybe you're mistaking me with somebody. Be careful. Be careful. Maybe you you think about some somebody else and you're talking to me, but it's not me who you mean, you know? I don't know. Now we'll do the, the belt. Uh, just a little belt like this. Always fine. Where to put it here, and uh, yeah, symmetrize. Then I will just make his waist a bit thinner, and then the belt will come like this. Can I retop one of the models for free? It will be a good practice for me. Uh, why not one of the models from from the stream? Why not? Write me in the Discord. I mean write to me in the discord or dm me in the discord people say dm i always said pm so private message they say dm which is dm which is dm dm what is dm direct message i think yeah but pm is you know pm uh, we say here in bulgaria when we drink plural pm we drink pm It's 8 p.m. What are you doing? Ah, p.m. Ah, no problem. Uh, p.m. What's happening? What do you want? Ah. What looks like Metro Man. Yeah, of course. Uh, Nico, if you are looking for a job in the collectible industry, we need to learn Substance Painter and Texturing. Uh, no problem, not. In the collectibles industry, Substance Painter? I don't think so. But you need anatomy, you need sculpting skills, uh, good ones. 
So that's why I'm teaching mostly basics, you know, anatomy, basic forms, shapes, how to do them and stuff like this. That's what I'm trying to teach people because those are the important things, the most important things. The other things like substance painter, texturing, uh, UV mapping, stuff like this, those are technical stuff. It's not, for me, it's not that important for an artist. We are an artist. Of course, for a studio, if you go to work for a studio, you have to know a lot of things. But if you are a very good sculptor, if you know your stuff, uh, you will be fine. And also those things are much easier to learn than anatomy, let's say. I mean, some programs like uh, Substance Painter or, you know, even ZBrush, but anatomy. That's why I advise most people to start with Blender, learn how to sculpt, learn, learn the anatomy with Blender, and then they can learn whatever program. It, 3D code, no problem. ZBrush, no problem. Just, you will know the basics of your stuff. That's the important part. Hello from Belarus. Hello Belarus. Do you do hard surface in ZBrush? Of course, if you saw my courses, you will see a lot of weapons and stuff, everything done in ZBrush. Would you say learning to draw will help with sculpting modeling? Definitely, yes. It's about how the 3D people work in the other branches, okay? Were you in the army for two years or so back in Bulgaria? How was it? I was in uh, for nine months. I've, it felt like two years, but it was nine months. And it was a very stupid experience, in my opinion. I mean, uh, my IQ dropped, like, for example, at least 20-25% in the, the army. I was smarter before, and then I was more stupid after the fact. But uh, you cannot do anything about it. It's, it's fine. You're in the army now. Oh, oh, you're in the army now. I don't know the, the lyrics exactly, but it's a very nice song. You're in the army now. Oh, oh you're in the army now. For posing characters, what's your deciding factor if you rig it or sculpting in already posed? Uh, these days, I always do it like basic, uh, basic pose like this with symmetry and everything. And then, like in Lobo course, I don't even uh, connect the body and the arms. And then I, uh, you know, do it. By the way, he looks pretty awkward, but whatever. And then I do the pose. That's what I was about to say. Yeah. And then I sculpt more. A lot more. Fiam. Yes. Cheers. <laughs> Nico, what's the distance salary for Bulgaria for a junior character artist? I'm asking in terms of negotiation. For a junior character artist, a distance salary could be nowadays around 250 leva for example 2050 leva which is about 1800 euro something like this or dollars very good your class your technique good your scope technique with the blender is really good i'm following here from brazil congratulations for the work thank you very much <laughs> oh. Yeah, the knees and the concept are almost snapping backwards, yes. Thank you for pointing that out, it's <laughs> definitely. So we have to do it, kind of. Okay, now I will do the cape, for example. Let's do the cape. Let's do a quick cape. So, cape, plane. Do this plane down here, put it back. Make it wider. And then, control R. Three times, okay? Then take this front things and extrude them on Y axis, which is forward like this. Uh, and extrude them again on Y axis, which is forward. And now these, extrude them down Z axis and extrude it to the bottom of the C. And then make it bigger. So the cape 
<coughs> it's very easy to do as you can see you can do it at home even without any tools any particular tools <coughs> i'm sorry about the coughing but i told you i'm not in the greatest of uh, shapes these days but as you can see i'm streaming and it's cool it's not a problem <coughs> All right. Hand grenade flying over your head. If you want to survive, get out of bed. Yeah. You're in the army now. <laughs> oh, oh, you're in the army. Probably talking that much in the stream doesn't make uh, my cough better. <laughs> but, you know, I like to talk. And I like it a lot. So, you can't stop me. Can't stop me. Can't touch this. Ma, 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 can't touch this. Oh, with the cape, uh, he looks more heroic. Without the cape, he was looking like, uh, what is this guy doing? But with the cape now, hmm. hero, definitely, you know. Why do you sculpt with Remesh and not Dinotopo? Thank you for this question very much. Next question. <coughs> Yeah, I will drink a little bit of water. I'm sorry. I'm trying to not cough on the microphone. So I will not uh, infect you guys. But uh, I, I also have this kind of thing, this soft thing on the microphone. It protects the microphone and yourself from the viruses from my mouth. So don't be afraid. It's okay. Everything is fine. <laughs> You will probably not get infected. Hopefully. You never know, but you know. You never know if you don't glow. <coughs> you never know if you don't go. You never shine if you don't glow, you know. Always. Alright. Nico, it's great to see you again. Oh. Thank you very much. It's great to see myself also. But Nico, can you show us some techniques how to flatten the surface like the soles in your model? Of course, I can. Press 3 on the numeric keyboard, then go here, take this tool, and do this. Then control, flatten. Amazing stuff. Then press home. Thank you for this question because now my uh, feet are completely flat and it looks better. So, <laughs> if you haven't uh, asked this question, probably my feet will be worst. So, you know, questions sometimes even help the streamer, which is great. Which is great. By the way, if I die from some illness these days, because I'm coughing and I maybe will not make it you know nobody will know people will ask but why nico is not streaming anymore this bastard has left us why is he doing that what's happening hello nico cemetery gaze by pantera versus fear of the dark by iron maiden which is superior in your opinion um you ask me i am for cemetery gates definitely but uh you know my favorite band was pantera back in the days you know, so that's why cemetery gates for me. <laughs> of course, you don't have to agree. It's completely my opinion. But fear of the dark these days, I listen more than cemetery gates. So, you know, it's a little bit strange. But still, cemetery gates, hmm, amazing song by Pantera. Although I'm not sure it's there. Uh, it's exactly their song, or it's a remake. I think it's remake, but I'm not sure. <coughs> Talking too much. Maybe I'll get a pill. For the throat, you know. Yes, thoughts on Andrew Cake. I don't know Andrew Cake. Sorry. Hello, first time doing the stream. Just wanted to say 
You have a great content and incredible skill. Thank you so much for everything you share about sculpting. Thank you. I'm already infected. Ah, I cannot do anything about it. I mean, some people are already infected and uh, also some people I'm infecting right now. But I'm hoping that I'm infecting you mostly with uh, uh, the love for sculpting. And when I'm gone, after a few days or something, I hope you will kind of remember what I've taught you and uh, you will be happy, you know, and so on and so on. Ah, so dramatic. Very cool. Drama is, uh, is a nice thing sometimes. I mean, it's interesting when we dramatize. At least for me, it's interesting. I don't know. Maybe for some people it's, Nico, why are you talking these stupid things sometimes? Because, you know, when you talk as much as me in my streams, in my courses, you cannot say only smart things. It's impossible. You know, it's just humanly impossible. So you will say a lot of stupid things. And I'm saying a lot of stupid things. I'm, I'm certain of that. So I accepted that. You can accept it too. It will be amazing. <clears throat> what do you record? I, I don't understand what's happening. Every. Every. Everybody. I heard some Pantera members are fascists now. I don't care. I don't care if they're fascists or they're <clears throat> like child molesters or murderers. I, I mean, I don't like them or their actions <laughs> outside the music. I just like their music. That's it. You know, it doesn't matter what the guys... For example, you don't know me. I may be some very bad guy. But you like my work, you like my courses, you like my uh, stream, for example. And, and it's okay. You don't have to like me because you don't know me. You know? My work, <laughs> you know. And other stuff. But me? Nobody knows me. Even me. Yeah, whatever. You cannot know everybody, you know. Let's do the cape a little bit more. Uh, subdivision surface modifier three times. Mm, edge data increase, increase. Very good. Now what I will do is um, very interesting. I will go and control R couple of times here because I will need more detail in this area. That's why I'm doing this. You will see why in just a few seconds. Um, so stay tuned. Now, what I was about to do is go to sculpt mode and press Q and symmetrize. Now it's symmetrical. Now solidify apply. Subdivision apply. The subdivisions are too, too low. Subdivision surface. Again, two times. Uh, the computer is starting to um, take the uh, problematic approach. Now, scope mode. Let's go. Let's go. <clears throat> but Nico, have you tried the post brush in Blender? Yes. I tried it. Ah, it's not my favorite brush. I mean, you, it can work sometimes. Sometimes it's complete crap. So, you know, it's just a question of, uh, you know, if you really can use it in your particular case. It's a case question. For the post brush itself. Oh, one hour already. Ooh. Ah. For uh, two hours, we will be able to do it with no issues at all. It will be like a walk in the park, we may say. You see, I'm just doing this and uh, you know capes they are very easy you just do this and then you just do this and then this it's so easy i mean why i, I don't know how people can have problems with capes they are so like easy it's, it's just like this no no problem at all but nico we cannot do this you're so much better than us <laughs> practice practice is the key and uh also not to not be afraid of mistakes. Because, you know, uh, whatever you do now, whatever model you're doing, it's not you, your life's work. Uh, it's not the greatest thing yet that you will ever create. No. It's something that you're doing. It's something that you're practicing with. 
just try some things, you know, practice. Ah, it's looking good. Nico, I saw you talking about politics in Brazil and I think you're mistaking some things. You said that Bolsonaro is bad, but the most bad of the two is actually Lula because he's a communist. <laughs> Maybe you're right, because you are for, probably from Brazil and you know better. <laughs> what do I know? I'm from the other uh, side of the world, you know. So probably you're right. Fake news in 3D life about politics in Brazil. I'm impressed. Lo <laughs> Lula, communist. What? So the chat is starting to get like Brazilians, you know, confronting each other about uh, their uh, Bolsonaro and uh, the other guy. Amazing. Try to do it in Brazilian, so uh, the other people will read only the English comments, you know, it will be amazing. Nico, what's your favorite music part in Anatomy? Ah, muscle part in Anatomy. Of course, the Sternocleidomastoid, I said it in the beginning of the video when we do it. The Sternocleidomastoid is the best uh, part, muscle, you know. Evil Nico confirmed, haha, <laughs> yeah, of course. I want to thank you so much, your courses are the best I have seen. Really? But you probably have, haven't seen a lot. So, see more courses, but thank you, thank you. I'm uh, joking, and thank you very much. <clears throat> I have a question, sir. I'm sculpting a creature in, in Zibush. I'm sorry about this, but I have a pill. And I want to give high-res details to it, but I'm not greening enough details and 16 million, so I have to go for subdivision level 7. I don't advise you to go <coughs> much higher. Ah, uh, in Zibush? Ah, if it's in zebra, you can go higher, no problem, it's okay. Uh, do you sculpt sometimes from all sketches, concepts? Uh, rarely, these days. Yeah, uh, back in the days I was doing that, but now not so much, because I don't have sketches anymore. I mean, I don't draw that much anymore. When I was drawing sometimes in work, uh, just between, you know, workings, uh, I was doing some things from my sketch, but yeah. Can you sculpt the face from scratch without symmetry from the beginning uh yes probably but it will be bad it will be bad but probably i can i'm pretty sure i can it will be a nice exercise by the way but for stream ah why not some sometimes we can try it will not be that interesting probably i will have to speak more stupid things than even than i'm doing now so people will be a little bit more interested and watch uh, not because of the sculpt itself, but because of my, uh, you know, constant uh, speaking. Greetings from Peru. Hello, Peru. My RAM is 16 gigabytes. Should I have to upgrade to uh, higher subdivisions? It depends. If your higher subdivisions are problematic, you have to upgrade, of course. Hi, Nico. I'm from Russia. Uh, Privet. You are a very interesting person. Thank you for your streams in this not easy time. They really help to distract. I just boast your streams on Torrent. <laughs> uh, my streams on torrent yeah yeah by the way i don't know if uh, in the russian trackers you have my courses but you, if you have it's a good thing because i hear that m most russians cannot buy courses even if they have the money you know uh, because of the problems with the payments and everything so yeah uh greetings for, that's definitely below two hours but we are not ready at all we need more time uh, but let's color it a little bit so it looks a little bit more, you know, ready. And then we'll continue. So, this blue will be for this, for this, uh, not for this, for this. So, the blue is ready. Now, uh, the red hot chili peppers. No, let's do the face. The face will be this color. Paint. I don't like it, but still, it's fine. Uh, this will be kind of a more dark. I have to find the white and dark and this. Okay. Then the cape will be kind of reddish. Or complete red. Uh, too much. Uh, but, but now I can go to scope mode. And take this. Take the value. And increase it and now it's fine and now we can go to flat mode here select this and you see now he looks even better than before 
<laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, but it looks better. I mean, it looks better. What's happening? Why is it looking better now? Whatever, let's go to scope mode. And a matcap. Select this. Go to the brush. Select this color. The ghost of communism scare Brazilians. Uh, it scares everybody, by the way. I'm also scared by the ghost of communism, so don't make fun of, of them. In Bulgaria, we also have a big communist, um, let's say, think. We have think for communists in Bulgaria too. Привет, can you talk some words in Russian? Хорошо, товарищ. Спасибо. Я не могу говорю по-русски. Я плохо говорит по-русски. Мы можем сказать это. Я только понимаю, не говорю. Не. This was a little bit of Russian. I said that I cannot speak Russian that much. And that's it. Uh, can you make a course on Batman armor that you have on our, our station? Yeah, this was my original Batman, by the way. Kind of original, let's say. Because, you know, the armor is just... I invented it uh, from my imagination. Now it looks a little bit better. I'm constantly touching my nose because it's itching me. I don't know why. But it's, you know... Probably because dead is near, and uh, you know that's why. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm joking about uh, things that are not supposed to be joked, but I don't care. You know, we can joke about anything if we want, if we so want. All right, we made this. Looks amazing. Nico, usually how long time for one 3D character is required in real work with the topology and textures? It's, uh, let's say about 30, 40, 50 hours. It, it depends on the character. It's, it, it's very, very complex character. The retopology can take a long, long time because it's mostly by hand and it's, it takes, it can take uh, a week or two. Vote Bolsonaro. <laughs> so, Bolsonaro supporters here and also the other guy supporters. Yeah. Did you try to sculpt a Pantera? Uh, no, but uh, I probably will be able to if I have uh, the right references. Hi from Uzbekistan. I'm glad that Uzbekistanians are also here. Live uh, uh, life. Is there an option to send you some designs concept for you to uh, sculpt? Of course, you can go to my Discord channel and try to send them, but uh, don't expect me to sculpt them because, you know, I always kind of make sure that they are sculptable for this amount of time that I'm using. I mean, from me, because, you know, for most people, this will not be sculptable in two hours, but for me, uh, it can be done. Some things can be done. Some things, no. Now. What I did here is stupid. Okay, control R. This will be the emblem, by the way, in the, the chest. So let's do it uh, in the sculpt mode. Oh, Terminator character through Blender. Yeah, if I find a right concept, very stylized version of the Terminator, I would probably gladly do it. But the real one, in uh, just two hours, it could be difficult, even for me, I would say. Even for Nico, it will be difficult. So this will be the emblem around this size, maybe a little bit bigger I will make it. And then, what to do? So, Control R. Control R again. So we will be able to just pull this up a little bit. And Q, symmetrize, okay. Now let's go and add solidify modifier. Pull this down. Okay. I'm not, uh, you know, when I'm sculpting this kind of kind of complica complex character because he has, you know, cape, he has uh, arms, legs, everything. I'm not able to keep up with the, the chat. It's, this is difficult. <clears throat> 
But Nico, what do you do for colorizing it after 3D printing? Nothing, I'm not colorizing. I probably will pay somebody to do it. Nico, how long do you have been doing 3D? This is a machine translation because I write in English badly, but I understand perfectly. Okay, um, how long? So the, my 3D uh, started in 2004, I think. So around 18 years now. But the characters, like uh, 12 or 13 years ago, I started the characters. Before that, there were other things. Subdivision surface modifier, materials, edge data, struck, 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 struck. <laughs> no, I'm just uh, making sure this is cool. Struck. Apply. Now, I applied the geometry. And then, oops, we don't want that. Now, what I will do, I will go to the body. I will increase the geometry of the body a lot, remesh it, smooth it, and with smooth body, he looks a little bit better, you know? Everything looks better smooth. Uh, then, what I will do is, I will try to do the emblem on his chest. I mean the S on his chest. Uh, not the S, but the S. Not the S, uh, whatever. Okay, now, I will mask. Um, how do I mask? With M, of course. With M, I will mask here, here, and around this area here, on top. Okay, now, we have the mask, and we continue doing it like this. Maybe it should be thicker, the border, but I have to draw it by hand, basically. That's a little bit confusing, maybe some, some people will say, but Nico, is there maybe another way, coming kind of more easy? <coughs> no. It probably is, but I don't know it, so I will do it by hand. So this will be our S, like this. Be careful, guys, this is difficult thing we are doing here. So, don't do this at home. It's not very easy to do it in this amount of time especially and you say but okay nico you're doing this mask how will you proceed from there i will extract it and then i will just uh, refine it a little bit and that's it but basically that's what i'm gonna do all i wanna do is have some fun i got a feeling I'm not the only one, all I gotta do... Oops. Here I will just make it a bit more like this. Here more kind of a rectangular, we may say. Товарищ, отлично говоришь по-русски. Спасибо, спасибо. Я... I'm trying. <laughs> I cannot say it. Do you have any original characters? Uh, yes, I have in my station some of my characters. Hi, Nico, I would he like to hear how you speak Bulgarian. He's very similar to Russian, Belarusian and Ukrainian. <coughs> da, Bulgarski je dosta blizak do Ruskija, Belaruskija i Ukrainskija. Taka je. No, всъщност, nekak si ne se razbiraju no, čak toliko je dobre. Osobno, Ukrainskija je zopšto ne bo znam. So, I said that... Uh, the Bulgarian is close to Ukrainian and uh, Serbian and Russian, but I cannot understand quite well the, uh, you know, especially Ukrainians. I haven't, uh, I mean, I haven't been uh, learning Ukrainian in school. They told us Russian back in the days, uh, in the communist times, because I'm old, but not Ukrainian. So, yeah, S. Okay, Q, max extract, okay, we wait, okay, now we inflate it a little bit, hello from Argentina, hello, move it, up, put everything together, okay, now move it forward and down, and we should be able to kind of work on it now. We need to smooth some areas and stuff. And basically this will take us a, a big chunk of our time. 
That's why it will be two hours instead of one hour and a half or something. Because we have to do this. Затвори вратата, бе. Тук говоря, ще събудиш децата. Да, мога да затваряш и да отваряш. I'm just uh, speaking to my wife here because she left the door open and you know. Hey, I'm right now with Blender and I got an issue with Nomad normals. Recalculating them is not working. I've been using Dynotopo. You... Uh, yeah, don't use Dynotopo is my tip. A very good tip. Yeah, many people are asking me, why don't you use Dynotopo? Uh, because of those things. Because, you know, people are asking them, uh, but I have problems because I'm using Dynotopo. Don't use it. You will be far better without using Dynotopo. I promise you. I mean, uh, just do what I do. And uh, you will be, fi be fine. Some things have to be sharp, by the way. Some uh, corners sh has to be sharp. That's why I'm doing them like this. Sharp. Just pinching them and they become sharper. Hopefully. Hopefully. Hmm. <laughs> you need to be over 13 to try this kind of difficult exercise with Blender, definitely, yes. Can you do a hard brush masking? I don't know, maybe. Am I doing a soft brush masking? Who knows? You can do whatever. You just have to work. Work, work, work until you do it. Doesn't matter. Funny how I don't understand a single word. Yeah, of course, it's uh, difficult. Uh, for example, if you start uh, speaking very quickly in Portuguese, I wouldn't understand a single word either. Love the channel, so why is Dana Topo bad? Because in this channel, we don't tolerate Dana Topo. We don't like it. If I could remove this Dana Topo from here, I would... No, I'm joking, of course. It's <laughs> I'm joking. Change enough uh, uh, the name of the channel to But Nico. Yeah, But Nico. The butt of the Nico. Guys, why I have only 60 better? Okay, yeah. 16 gigabytes sometimes will work, especially with uh, ZBrush. Hello from New Zealand. Hello. Great tutorials. Thank you very much. Greeting from Serbia. Ooh, Serbia. Very good. Uh, Nico, PLA or resin, resin? Resin printer. 3D printer, resin. Forever. Is it a good workflow for game? Is it a good workflow for game ready characters? Don't write this kind of uh, complex uh, words. I, I I cannot read them. It's difficult for me. And then bake everything from multires. Mm. Yes. Hi there from France. Bonjour. Bonjour from France. No, I'm not from France. But I speak bonjour. But everybody can say bonjour, you know. It's not a difficult thing to say. French. Bonsoir. Okay. But that word is not for you. Bonsoir. Что bonsoir, eh? Ah, bonsoir is good night. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, it's a. Uh, Good evening or something, yes. Bonsoir. Mm -hmm. Hi, Cannibal Corp Singer. Uh, thank you very much. Hello from the Dominican Republic. Hello. Hi, Nico. Thanks for the course Blender 3 character for beginners. I don't know English well and I use a neutral, neutral network translator with subsequent voice acting from... Wow. Amazing. Neural network, to, uh, we are so far away into the future these days. I'm amazed. By the way, you should uh, share how you do it uh, in the Discord channel. Because many people will probably want um, to use that. Especially Russians. Because they are always asking me, Nico, why don't you make your, uh, your courses in Russian? Because I don't really speak Russian. I just understand it a little bit. Let's say like 70%. So this neural network stuff, stuff, stuff will be very useful for many people. Even for me, maybe I can watch courses in some other languages and be fine. This has to be read, by the way. Do you know that? 
Red. Wow, not this red. What? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. No problem. Um. All right, now this inside has to be yellow. So let's do kind of a bright yellow. Nah, it's, uh, it's fine. No, it's not. It has to be a little bit more orangey yellow. Uh, still, it's not good, but whatever. Can't touch this. Dun, 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 can't touch this. Greetings from Macedonia. Oh, Macedonia, very good. Uh, I have 8 gigabytes of RAM, no sculpting, 2 millions or above vertices. Until 2 millions. Yeah, until 2 millions, and then it ha, crashes. Did you try to dot yourself in 3D? Um, I have tried, but it's not working very well because it needs patience, it needs more time. And as you can see, I'm a guy who doesn't like to uh, do things for too much, uh, too long. I mean, I work quickly and efficiently, as you probably noticed already. I like to do things very fast. Hey, Nico from Mars. Hello. From Mars, you say. I'm from Snickers. Yeah. We are together, Mars and Snickers. Symmetrize. Okay, we'll wait. Okay, good, 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 good. Now what I will do is very fast colorize the eyebrows. I will not make them separately because we don't need that type of detail, detail here. It's okay for them to be just like this. And also I will not make eyeballs yet. But if I have to print it, 3D print it, I probably will put some eyeballs. Now you're noticing, but how are you not changing the colors and drawing with uh, the other color? Uh, because I'm using control. And control is for the, the other color. Just, you know, ah, just tricks and stuff. Very, very tricky stuff. But Nico, why are you coloring the nostrils and the other parts, because I want. I like it. Maybe his head is a little bit too small, but uh, he looks more heroic this way, so it's fine. Yeah, we have it. It's, it's uh, relatively fine. I'm not super happy with it, so I will continue working a little bit more, like half an hour more, and we will get to a better shape. Probably. We'll see. The whole world watching Nico. Yeah, there are people from all over the world. I'm very happy about that. Is it possible to make brushes for Blender? Probably. I haven't tried. I think Laura G Ginger. Laura Ginger? Whatever. Uh, this girl from uh, uh, Outgang. Laura. So Laura, I think that she has made some brushes or she ha has made some trials on brushes in Blender. She's more technical than me. I mean, she's trying things. I'm not, I'm just sculpting. I like just to sculpt, you know, just the basic act of sculpting without too much thinking about different brushes or stuff. Just sculpt with the default brushes. It's, you know, it's okay. It's not gonna hurt you to sculpt with the default ones. In my opinion, at least. Oh, we don't have symmetry here. Oh, it's cool. I'm doing just a little bit of things. All right, so I will do the the front part of, of why did I do this circle? What happened now? X, delete, now shift A and UV sphere. No, I don't want the sphere. It's getting late here and I'm just, uh, you know, it's starting to mess with my head a little bit. Mm. Are you using your mouse to do this? Sometimes I'm using my mouse for some things, but only for modeling, for sculpting. I'm teaching character art in my uh, local university and your videos convinced me to teach it using Blender instead of ZBrush. Oh, that's a pretty, pretty good thing, yeah. I still ZBrush, use ZBrush for my own stuff, but I feel like teaching Blender is more cool. Definitely, definitely. And uh, by the way, I started using Blender for my all for all of my stuff also because you know I'm teaching people and I'm telling them that Blender is good but if I don't do it myself what kind of teacher I am 
That's why I am using Blender for everything that I do these days. Uh, like already for 10 months. I've done for Gameloft, I've done like uh, 10, 15 characters, I'm not sure how much with ZBrush. So with Blender, I'm sorry, with ZBrush a lot more, but with Blender I did a lot. So yeah, Blender is the best. No, it's not. But it's cool. So it's good enough. See, I'm just remeshing those things because I want to be quicker. And remeshing is quicker. And now I will do something very stupid, but I have to do it. <laughs> yeah, many people will say, but Nico, what, what are you doing? This is not how it's done. I know. I know, but, but I'm sorry. It's uh, just faster and more efficient way of doing it right now. Uh, otherwise, I will do it separately with a separate mesh in my courses. But this, I told you, this channel is for fun. So don't take uh, too much of the things that I do here as granted. God damage. By the way, uh, this is easy now. Easy fix. I will go here. Uh, plus X to minus X. Symmetrize and it will fix it. But, yeah. No, it's symmetrical. Yeah, sometimes... I forget to uh, that I don't have symmetry. Sometimes I have symmetry, whatever. Hello from Northern Ireland. Ha! Huh. I was there, by the way. I, I went to Dublin. I went to Belfast. I went to... Yeah, Dublin and Belfast. It was very cool, by the way. In Belfast, there was a, this taxi guy. There are taxi guys who are, uh, you know... Uh, you are driving around the city and they, they are telling you stories about uh, the past things, about the war, basically. It was not exactly war, but it was something like a war. In there, it, it was very interesting in Belfast. In Dublin, I visited the, the zoo, very nice zoo we have there in Dublin. Amazing, with the monkeys and everything. Very cool. So yeah, Northern Ireland. It was very cold, by the way. I was, well, I was in the... Um, Oh, uh, and it was Christmas, in the Christmas time, and it was not below zero even, but it was so cold, it was amazingly cold, because it, it was probably wet, I mean not wet, but m mild, it was mm, kind of wet, the air was wet and it was very cold, and the wind and everything, yeah. but other than that, pretty amazing. Laura Gall Gallagher. Ah, Gallagher, no Ginger. Okay, Gallagher. I'm sorry about that. I butchered her name. Uh, I'm sorry. It's not a good thing to do, but. Ah, uh, yeah. So, from Outgang. Everybody knows about Outgang, I guess. If you are into sculpting, if you are into this kind of things, you know, you probably know Outgang. She has a relatively new channel. It's like, uh, I, I think it's about two years now or three years, I'm not sure. Her channel in the in YouTube. But she's doing good things, I guess, for the community. So check her out. Laura from Outgang. She also has a website. Um, Outgang.com or I'm not sure how it's uh, exactly the website. But... It's a subscription-based site, and you can subscribe and uh, watch all the courses there and stuff. And uh, she's a very good artist, I might say. She's a very good artist. I'm not sure how she is as a teacher. Probably some people here can say. But as an artist, uh, she's good. So probably she can teach you stuff. I'm sure she can. Would you ever consider doing tutorials? I was thinking about doing some courses or tutorials. Um, but we'll see. Someday maybe I will do some. Maybe. I don't know. Look in the description of this video and uh, you will see some things. But yeah, maybe. Maybe someday tutorials. Maybe some video course. Maybe I will upload some video course in, U in Udemy or in our station. Who knows? This could happen. This could happen. You have to believe. I have to believe in myself and 
these things could work. Yeah. I'm sculpting using my mouse. That's completely okay. I mean, you can do it. It's not a big issue. I did it sometimes, so yeah, you can do it. Oops. S. Okay, let's make the pants a little bit better. Let's go here, select this color and color this thing. Okay, now for the for the arms, I like them to be a little bit more interesting. So, <clears throat> yeah, I should do tutorials. I should do courses. I should try to go into this business of making courses online. <clears throat> That's a good idea. That's a pretty good idea, I would say. Maybe. But isn't it hard to do? I mean, you have to constantly uh, speak in front of a camera. Probably I will be a, a kind of, you know, uh, camera to, to, fo to, to photograph and then people will watch you. Probably it's hard. I don't know if I will be able to do that. It's, it's too hard, probably. No, it's not for me. No. But thank you anyway. It's, uh, it's cool that you think that I can do it. It's very cool. Super chat. Can you show us some characters that you did for Heroes of the Dark? Mm, I'm not sure I can, by the way. <laughs> yeah, uh, the one character that I did that everybody sees and know is the character that I have in my YouTube channel, in my other channel. And you know it. Uh, the whole process of the making of the character is made as a course and it's absolutely free in my YouTube channel. You can watch it. It's like 30 hours or something of content. Maybe less, I'm not sure. I don't like this muscles on the front, but now he's looking relatively cool. <laughs> I like his pose like eh. <laughs> I've been watching Outgang, love that channel. Very cool. So, uh, I'm not advertising her in vain. So, probably it's a good place to learn. Very good. And not only the channel, I, I think if, if you like the channel, probably you will like the content in the website. Uh, I mean, the courses. So, yeah. By the way, I heard that they're also in the torrents, like mine, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I, I haven't checked out exactly about that. But she shouldn't worry about that much uh, for the torrent. I mean, the people who are usually going to the torrents, they usually will never buy your stuff. So, <laughs> why bother? I mean, yeah, torrents. Okay, go. No problem. It's Gotta say, you got me back into sculpting. Love watching the work. Thanks again for the videos. Thank you very much. It uh, sounds very nice. Vecher dobre. Isn't it uh, the other way around? Dobre vecher. Dobre vecher, daragia tavarishi and uh, tavarishi i... I don't know how is tavarishi. Uh, tavarishi is uh, guys, but in old, a little bit old, uh, like communist times. At, at least that's why, that's how we used it. You definitely have the skills to get a job in the industry of tutorials. Yeah, I have to try it, probably. If I want to sculpt characters, should I also develop drawing, like to understand proportions and anatomy better? It's not mandatory if you want to sculpt uh, to be better in drawing, but it's fun. So I guess it's always nice. It's never a bad thing to learn how to draw. I mean, so go for it. Don't worry. We got your back. Not in the bad way. You know, in a good way. Not in the way of, you know. Ah. I just missed the Zuri measure. Yes, I, I also miss it. But uh, that's why we have the Quadra measure here. It's the same. But it's paid. <laughs> О, уже нашелся человек, понимающий меня. Привет. А, да, я понимаю, but uh, <coughs> it's not good. I mean, uh, you should speak or write in English here. 
in the channel because uh, yeah for everybody to understand not just me it's better to to be understood by, by everybody and also i like to speak so everybody can understand me since i'm the host of this show <laughs> we might say <clears throat> If we consider this a show, but it's something like a show. Yeah, we may say it's a show. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. So, yeah. What do you think about posting projects from YouTube streams like this for portfolio with mention? <clears throat> oh, absolutely okay for me. I mean, I like when people are saying, I did this uh, and uh, I got the idea from the stream of Nico and something completely okay. I feel happy. You know, you know, uh, for a guy like me who doesn't have anything against the torrents, even uh, to ask me these questions, you can do whatever. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. I'm not the guy who will say oh, trade rights infringement or whatever. <laughs> yeah, Nico is so good, amazing guy, amazing. Buy his courses. I love you, Nico. Armando. Why did you say that? You don't say that to a guy. You know? Don't do this. <laughs> I'm joking. It's okay. How old are you? <clears throat> I am... Um, if you ask how old I am in here, in my mind, I'm like 64. But uh, my usual age, like normal age, is 41. I will be exactly 41 uh, at 1st of December, when is my birthday. And maybe I will stream there in my birthday. Why? But Nico, how could you stream on a birthday? Because I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. Uh, it will be fun, I guess. And I will put um, donations through YouTube. So people can donate me money from, for my birthday for YouTube. Huh? What, what? Very good idea. Very good idea. I don't know if I can do that, but whatever. It uh, sounds like a super cool idea. <laughs> Can you speak Turkish? Um, teşekkürler, uh, teşekkür ederim. Merhaba, nasılsın? Stuff like this. I can speak a little bit. No, I cannot. I knew few words, just few words, just to, you know... Bir küfte... Uh, something like this. Bir ekmek. Ekmek is bread. So, if you have to know something in Turkish, you have to know ekmek. Because you have to know how to ask for food. And also su, which is water. So, su, ekmek, uh, water and bread. I also know how is fire. Ateş. Because uh, when I watched Rambo in Turkish, don't ask me why. And when they uh, fire their weapons, like, fire, you know, Atesh! When they shoot. You know. <laughs> Amazing stuff. Uh, you know, very cool. Durbe Rambo. Very cool. Greetings from Bangladesh. Thank you very much, Bangladesh. You're so awesome. <laughs> Wow, I didn't know that you can speak Russian. No, I cannot quite speak it. I can understand it. And I can, if I remember the words, I can kind of say a few things, but no. Ah. Tay, tay, tay. Nico, do you prefer keyboard and mouse over drawing tablet? If so, why? Keyboard and mouse over the drawing tablet? What are you saying? I'm a sculptor, digital, digital sculptor. This is my tool. This is... Th this is the thing I I mean you cannot do it without this it's it's impossible Nico I'm learning anatomy with your course is it going it's going pretty easy thank a lot for course so why you switch to blender for sculpt I mean especially for the anatomy courses uh, it doesn't matter in which software they are I mean it's sculpting it's anatomy it's just showing you anatomy it's uh, what well, doesn't matter um but why did I uh, switch to Blender? Because it's more fun to teach people Blender than to teach them ZBrush. Because it's free, everybody can access it. And yeah. Because some people doesn't have torrents. 
not us, not the Russians, but some people doesn't have torrents. And they need to have access to sculpting. And Blender is giving them this access. Obviously, Blender is very good for sculpting. Now the arms are looking much better, but no, from some areas. Yeah, definitely if I'm gonna uh, 3D print this, I will have to work, I will have put, to put like at least three to four, five more hours into it. It doesn't, it's not gonna work like this. But for now it's uh, working. Let's put some shadow and cavity, just to see how it looks. Yeah, with shadow and cavity it looks even better. So, yeah, we have it. So now, only question answering, and it will be amazing. He is not that pushed forward as the concept, by the way. Hmm. I'm not sure. Maybe we should push him even forward, more forward. Now it will be a little bit more difficult because we already have all of these things, but not super difficult. I think it's, it's kind of all right. Uh, we got the idea. Yeah, and in the concept, as you notice, this is a common issue with the 2D drawings. That he is not only forward, but he is sideways. He is on his right. His whole body is a little bit on his right, and he looks more like this. If I do this, I have to push him on, on the right a little bit. So, yeah. Whatever, it's okay. I'm 42 graphic and web designer trying to learn 3D. You will do very good. I mean, you have to just put the time and don't expect to happen in a few months. But if you put enough time on this, it can happen in a few, in, even in one year. I've seen people uh, go from not very good to very good in one year. But Nico, what? I saw but Nico. <laughs> Perfect pronunciation. Ah, for the Turkish. Ah, you know. Turkish, your Turkish is very fluent. Have you lived there before? No, no, no. But I came from, in, in Bulgaria, we have a very big Turkish community. It's around like, maybe uh, around 9, 10% of Bulgarian population speaks Turkish. They're kind of, they speak Turkish. And um, from where I come from, from the place that I come from, there's a lot of Turkish people there. So in my class, when I was, in the in school we had few turkish guys they speak bulgarian perfectly they live in bulgaria they are born in bulgaria but they kind of accept themselves like turkish and they uh, have turkish names and they uh, watch turkish tv and they know turkey <clears throat> they know they know the language so i asked them to teach me some words so i know a few words hmm. hey can you make Captain America next time, but the movie suit, uh, it will be very difficult, it's very detailed. As you can see, I can do for two hours, or even less, this thing, but it's not very detailed. If we have a lot of detail, it will be very difficult, I mean, oh, next to impossible, so, yeah. Blender gives me more money than ZBrush, yeah, yeah. Blender, <laughs> Blender, so, Blender uh, called me and uh, said, Nico. If you gave, give up ZBrush for Blender, we will give you $5. And I said, but uh, an hour or what? No, no, just $5. We don't have much more. And I said, okay, guys, I love you. I will accept this offer. So now I have $5 more because of Blender. You know, everything is good. Nico, what tablet are you using? I'm using, let me show you. <clears throat> This is my tablet, one by Wacom. And inside here, I have a brand new tablet. It, it, this is inside here. And it's not brand new, it's second hand, but it was not used. I just bought it from uh, the Bulgarian version of eBay. Uh, uh, there are a lot of tablets out there uh, that people are giving to other people as a gift. This is one by Wacom tablet, um, medium version. They're giving them uh, these tablets and the people are never using them and they're selling them pretty cheap. So you can bump into this kind of offer. I bought it for like $40 or something. It's pretty cool. Can you speak Persian? Yes, of course I can speak Persian. But I cannot show you because it's um, it's a secret. Sculpt Rambo. If I find a good concept of Rambo, I will sculpt it. Blender gives you more money? Yes, of course. Poor torrentless people, of course, yeah. Nico, what tablet are you using? Yes. 
Uh, do you like to travel? How did you learn so many languages? At least more than two. Uh, I travel a lot, yeah. I, I like to travel a lot. I don't travel too much, but I love traveling uh, these days. Yeah. Uh, like, if you asked me seven years ago, I haven't traveled at all. I haven't left Bulgaria seven years ago, I think. But when I met my current wife, now I have traveled to Thailand, to Vietnam, to Brazil, to Argentina, Spain, southern Spain, very nice, Italy, Sicilia, Greece a lot of times, Romania a couple of times, Turkey, Japan, China, and yeah, uh, Zanzibar, Egypt, pretty cool, I would say. So those are the, the countries that I visit so far. But I like to visit more. And uh, even to some countries like Thailand, for example, I like to go back there. It's a little bit far away, but uh, probably yeah. United States also. I would like to visit the Grand Canyon and stuff like this. I would like to visit the Philippines. They have a lot of islands, very beautiful stuff. I like to visit um, India, of course. The food there is also amazing. Uh, I would like to visit... China, again, it's a pretty big country, so you cannot see just Shanghai and uh, you visited China. China is okay. No, uh, Japan, again, of course, I like to visit. And a lot of countries, it's uh, amazing. Why did you switch to ZBrush to Blender? So, no, you cannot ask this question. You have to ask, but Nico, why did you switch from ZBrush to Blender? And that will be, you know, because they pay me. Blender pay me $5 and I switched. Nico, with the time you have now using Blender, where do you feel more comfortable in ZBrush or Blender? Or, for example, if you need to do work character like that, where would you go? Uh, hmm. If you have, if I have to do a character for work like this, I will do it in Blender because I did it in Blender uh, for work uh, a lot of times. But mm, I feel more comfortable in Blender right now. But if I have to do something in ZBrush, for example, it takes me around five minutes to get used to the interface, and I'm okay. Turkish delight are so good, uh, definitely. Why did you switch from Blender? Okay. Ever wonder what it will be like to have your sculptor work feature prominently in a public setting? I don't know. I don't know. What do you think about connection don donates to your stream? Uh, probably it will be okay. I just uh, don't know how to do it and I haven't researched. So maybe I will at some point if I need money. For now, I'm kind of okay. It's, uh, you know, maybe next month. We'll see <laughs> if the next month is like not selling too much courses oh, and I will need money. Nico, you can make Captain America. I trust you. Make him on your birthday if you want. <laughs> okay. Nico, why don't you use Super Chat for your stream so people can donate money? Super Chat. I don't know what, what is this. I'm not super familiar, you know. I, I'm a young streamer, we may say. I stream for one month now. It's not that I'm uh, streaming for you know, long months and days and, you know. I have a uh, Wacom Intuos Pro small size. Yeah, good, very good. I uh, uh, I use that kind of tablet, small Wacom Intuos, uh, in the academy that I'm teaching. It's pretty good. I mean, it works very, very nicely. Do you have any drawings? Yeah, I showed uh, some of my drawings in the last... Uh, you can check them out in the end part of the last stream about uh, Batman. No, the last stream. What did I do on the last stream? I don't remember. I'm doomed. It was something interesting. I don't know. Let's see. Uh, not this Batman. Not this. No, 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 no. Not the God of War. What did I do? Not the soup. Ah, I did the uh, yeah the Hulk. <laughs> now I remember. Yeah. So uh, the stream of the Hulk. I'm planning to do this also, but I'm not sure if I will be able to to do it properly. But I, I have to try. Also, this Superman looks very nice. It's very 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 nice. I like how thin is his ankle here. It's amazing. I'm not sure how it will look in 3D. That's why I will do the test. But we'll see. That's awesome. Where did you went in the Brazil? Just 
Rio de Janeiro and uh, Iguazu, the waterfall, or some kind of citizen of the world. Yeah, I kind of understand people from different nationalities. But Nico, uh, why do you never visit my home, Las Vegas, USA? Ooh, I would love to visit uh, Las Vegas, USA, or, or many places in USA. But you see, uh, to USA is a pretty big country, and there are a lot of things that I want to see there. Las Vegas, I want to see California, Los Angeles, for example. I want to see the Big Canyon, the Yellowstone Park, and many, many other things. It will take me a lot of time. So I have to kind of get my things in order. I have to uh, be able to make uh, money from my courses without working too much and stuff like this. It will, there is time, hopefully, if we are alive and healthy, like how we say it here in Bulgaria. Yeah. Is there a feature in Zebras that you would like to see in Blender? Yeah, moving easily, the pivot will be very nice in sculpt mode. I like this because he's skinny. Yeah, the... yeah. From a long time I want a skinny character like this. Yeah, I heard that, yeah. Did you try to read code for sculpting? They're always asking me that. No, I haven't. I mean, I use Blender. Mr. Nico, are you participating in Zuber Sculpt of... No. Persian Secret. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Hill, Hillboy, I like to watch your stream so much, watching your stream now and now watching Friends TV show. It's the same, I mean, me and uh, Friends, the same. Make Goro from Mortal Kombat, four arms. It will be easy, I mean, I will do uh, just one arm and then, you know, mirror and then copy-paste. It will be easy. Fos de Iguazo, yes. Can you make a speed sculpt live in ZBrush? Of course, but I am not uh, doing that. I mean, I'm using Blender. I'm showing people that Blender is good enough for sculpting. I mean, everybody knows that ZBrush is good enough for sculpting. Everybody knows that. But Blender, not many people are familiar with that Blender is very good for sculpting these days. So that's what I'm kind of showing. And I think I am uh, doing a good job in that. I hope I am, at least. But Nico, Deadpool will be a good choice to sculpt, don't you think? Yes, but he has more detail, more accessories and stuff. So if I find a, a, a good concept, probably I will do it. Why not? Why don't you sculpt Sip Zero for Mortal Kombat in stylized form? It will be cool if I find a good concept. You know, I'm not using... Uh, I'm, it's not a good idea to do something without concept. See? Concept, always. Do you use Marvel Designer? Uh, not so much. I want to use it more, but I am so lazy. I'm having a bad feeling that the end of the stream is near. It's very near. What is your favorite character design ever? I don't know. I don't know. But Nico, what's the secret to a successful marriage? Ah, compromise. You have to compromise. You have to uh, get your ego and just put it in your pocket and don't show it too much. Uh, it's, it's easier said than done, but you have to try. Yeah, marriage advisors. You can always ask me that. I know that. Although I'm not exactly technically married, but I know stuff. Believe me, I know stuff. I'm old and I know stuff. Let's do a little bit of thing here. Yeah, this is more interesting. Is a blue shirt in 3D like a black belt in martial arts? Um, <clears throat> maybe. Who knows? Nico, how do you merge all the models in order to look as a single piece? Is by remeshing after merge? Yes, I'm remeshing after merge most of the time. Although you can do it in other ways, but I'm doing this. Checking YouTube Studio if you have more than 4,000 hours of channel views. You sure have it. You might be ready to monetize this channel. Ha, maybe. Maybe. We'll see. Your work is inspiring and educational. Thanks for the stream and the videos. Thank you. But Nico, where do you find concepts? I search the internet for concepts. Yeah, I know this sounds like, uh, you know, something that, you, oh, but Nico, how do you do that? Why internet? Isn't it forbidden? No, it's not in Bulgaria. We can search the internet. We can go to Google. I know. I know, it sounds very scary, but you can try it. You can go to Pinterest 
and you can go even the day I found out that even in uh, uh, what was the name of this thing? Deviant art. Deviant art also is possible. Also, so be afraid. No, be uh, be advised. Don't be afraid. It's cool. Uh, I'm in a two-year long distance relationship and I'm already over it. Any advice? <laughs> uh, no. Zebrish is the past, Bender is the future. Uh, let's not get that uh, ahead of ourselves. I mean, you know. Nico, tell us where are the best three things to do when visiting Sofia. Ah, what's the best three things to do when visiting Sofia? Uh, I'm not sure. You can do whatever. You can check in the internet, by the way. Ben 10 alien characters, please. Oh, I saw a guy who is making them very, very nicely. The Ben 10 characters these days. I mean, recently. Very cool. Amazing. I'm amazed. How can I put a picture in Blender like you are doing in your lives? This is a um, separate program, which is called Pure Ref. So, Pure Ref. Like, Pure ref Reference. It's an amazing program, and you can have a lot of i mean this all these pictures i have collected for a long time and uh yeah and i'm practicing with uh, all of this i did this yesterday today i did um from this i watched this and i did it and also i did this head i may show you by the way let's go to superman test uh, two, yes, this was my uh, test today. The day I did that, and I no, the heads are not here. The heads are probably here. Yeah, this is one of the heads. Looking cool. This is another head. What is this? Ah, uh, this is another test of something. I just uh, did a little test of the Batman. One of the Batmans uh, here. I think it was this one. I probably will do some stream about this Batman. Why not? It's looking cool. But let's get back to our Superman now. The stream one. Bro, what's the so shortcut for that subdivision that you did? Ah, uh, Shift R. First you show the, the grid. And then you move the mouse. And then you make it smaller and bigger. But be very careful not to make it too small. And then when you're ready, you just press Control R to apply the grid. To apply the level of detail. It's very cool. Hannibal Baraka. <laughs> Well, then I guess Venom sculpt will, oh, Venom, Venom sculpt will be very good. But Nico, how do you feel knowing that you can sculpt anything you want in just a couple of hours? Is that a superpower? Yeah, it feels a little bit like a superpower. Yeah, I, I know. It sounds uh, pretty, you know, but it's true. It feels like. Thank you for this good stream. I just saw you. You have great works. Thank you very much. Um, stylized safe portrait, Nico, sir. <laughs> difficult. Yes, I also Ben 10 characters in our station, which was done recently. Amazing stuff. I cannot do this. I mean, very good. And the render is also very nice. There's a lot of work and a lot of hours put in these characters. Not just two hours on stream and like this, you know, very lazy, like Nico. Nico is pretty lazy, by the way. That's why he's so fast, because he's lazy. Uh, nice golem concept. Uh, probably. Awesome Batman. Yeah, the Batman was not in the... It, it was not stream. Ah, why am I showing this Batman since I'm doing Superman? Yeah, we have to do this also. This guy, probably it will be nice. Although, uh, a, a stream, I mean, two hours to do something with a pose, uh, it will be a challenge. But challenge, we love challenges. I need to go because it's cool tomorrow. Yeah, go. It's cool. Yeah, also, I have to go to... The kindergarten tomorrow, <laughs> but to bring my uh, my girl. Are you using a stable version of Blender to switch between meshes in sculpt mode? Yes. Very stable. 3.3. .3. Nico, my wife says it's either her or Blender. Should I still use ZBrush? 
<laughs> I'm keeping Blender, but I needed advice. Should I still use ZBrush too? You can use ZBrush secretly in the bathroom and Blender in front of her, you know. Ah, is it her or Blender? Ah, you mean that she will leave you if you continue using Blender? Hmm, interesting. That's interesting. We need hands. Here we go. Talk to the hand. No problem. Yeah. Uh, no, I have hand tutorial in my other channel and also fist one. The other channel is called just Speed Char. This is Speed Char Life. This is the newest. One month ago, I created it. Uh, Nico, how did you overcome your midlife crisis? I haven't got to it yet, I think. So, no, I bought I bought a car. I bought a Mercedes E Class. Maybe this was my middle class, uh, middle life crisis. I don't know. Probably. Who knows? Uh, is Blender hands down? <laughs> if she can't love you at your Blender, then she can't have you at your ZBrush. Pretty well said. Very well said, I would say. Exodus. Exodus. You said it very well. Exodus is uh, exit in Greek. In Latin, I think. Have you ever been to Cyprus? Yes, I was. I've been to Cyprus. Um, maybe it was three years ago. No, four or five years ago. Yes. But Nico, why creating a secondary channel? Uh, because this is for fun. This channel is only for fun. It's not that educational. It's nothing. Just for fun. Just answer questions. Just. Uh, just kind of having conversations between us, between me and you and you and me and everything, you know. Tell us the specs of your PC, my man. I always say that, but I will say it again. It's a Ryzen 3950X 16 core processor, 64 gigabytes of RAM, uh, and uh, GeForce, it's... Uh, RTX 2080 video card. That's it. Nico, do you have HP ZBook? My wife has something like that. I think it's uh, ZBook, yeah. Do you have any freelance tips for character modeling? Mm, no, I, I'm not doing freelance recently. <laughs> can you share a personal project in the Discord for feedback? I'm new. Yes, of course you can. Uh, there are people in the Discord, by the way, which are um very helpful not only me sometimes i'm giving feedback but very rarely but there are people who will help you in the discord channel uh they are very how to say helpful you keep interacting and talking about funny topics by doing this the stream flows so thumbs up yeah thank you the other channel is just speech -ar. no it's not just speech -ar. it's speech -ar, not just speech -ar. be careful so, speed char. I have an RTX 3070 Ti, which is better than my video card. And uh, the process, your processor is a little bit old, I think. Is it good for Blender? But it's good for Blender if you have enough RAM. 32 gigabytes is fine. Have you tried Nomad Sculpt? Yes. Yes. I always see that you're sculpting some people, create primary planes first and then sculpt from them. It's uh, completely okay. What's your focal length? 88. Most of the time I use 88. Can you show us some characters that you did recently for Gameloft? Um, uh, maybe. Maybe someday. I will have to ask, probably, Gameloft and uh, get back to you at some point. Okay, guys. Do you plan to stream something of female characters? Yes, of course. Since I'm streaming every other day, so tomorrow probably I will not stream, but the day after tomorrow I probably will stream. Uh, I have to stream all other all things, so probably female characters will be. And goodbye, because this uh, become the very big, I mean, 2 hours and 9 minutes too much. Bye for now and see you in the next stream.